Sunshine Coast University Private Hospital offers the Sunshine Coast's widest range of cardiac diagnostic and therapeutic services, including the region's only cardiothoracic surgical program. Hear from a couple of our cardiology specialists about the blending of surgical skill with technology. This is a transcatheter aortic valve. Uh, it, it is the latest technology to help patients with severe aortic stenosis and it's inserted like a stent through someone's leg artery up to the heart. Revolutionised the treatment of aortic stenosis, which is a narrowed heart valve, and we can now offer it to all of our patients. Until we had this TAVI valve, all of my patients with severe aortic stenosis had to go to Brisbane and have open heart surgery, a week in hospital, and a prolonged recovery. But now we have access to TAVI from the Sunshine Coast. My patients can come into our local hospital, have a new heart valve put in, and a quarter of them go home the next day. The technology has progressed enormously over the past five to 10 years. It's assisting us to be able to treat our older patients. Improved technology means a lower profile catheter, which means that at centres like ours, uh, we can offer the latest technology and you know, the state of the art uh, catheter lab and locally, so patients can come and have it all done. This is the mitral clip. This is a technology that is used for these patients with severe mitral valve regurgitation, which is leaking mitral valves who were previously unable to be treated by conventional surgery. The clip is like a peg that grabs onto the mitral valve leaflets, which, tech, which traditionally are flying back through the mitral valve annulus. It will pull it back together, um, creating a a seal so there's no significant leak back through this, these valves. So heart patients are complex. Traditionally this was done with open heart surgery. Our patients too sick to have open heart surgery were condemned to not really having any procedures at all. And this technology allows us to be able to treat people who previously had prohibitive surgical risk. With the advancement of technology we have a new set of tools to be able to provide care for these patients.